Much debate circulated as to the reality of the seemingly U.S. future fastest bomber to have ever made. Fondly dubbed as the son of the Blackbird, there is no doubt that the production of the SR-72 Dark Star is still ongoing. But whether it will be ready for flying remained to be a question. Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Military TV. In today's episode, we are going to talk about the U.S. Lockheed Martin SR-72 Dark Star. If you want to know more about this future aircraft, relax and stay until the end of this video. The Lockheed Martin SR-72 Dark Star is an American-made hypersonic unmanned aerial vehicle UAV intended to be in service for intelligence, reconnaissance, and surveillance privately proposed by Lockheed Martin as a successor to the retired Lockheed SR-71 Blackbird. The proposed reliance on incredibly high speed to infiltrate defended airspace is considered an essential movement from the U.S. side since the growth of anti-satellite weapons, anti-access area denial tactics, and counter-stealth technologies give way to high-speed aircraft that could penetrate protected airspace and strike a target before the enemies could detect or intercept it. Moreover, the SR-71 Blackbird, which was retired by the United States Air Force USAF in 1998, left a huge coverage gap between surveillance satellites, unmanned aerial vehicles for intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance ISR, and strike missions. There were several unconfirmed reports about the development of SR-72, which dated back to 2007, when some sources claimed that Lockheed Martin is in the process of developing a future hypersonic airplane for the USAF. And then, on the 1st of November 2013, Aviation Week and Space Technology magazine shed some lights about Lockheed Martin's advanced development program, ADP Skunk Works, development on the SR-72. At that time, the public were quite interested with the development of the future airplane. Subsequently, in June 2017, Lockheed Martin then announced that the SR-72 would be in development by the early 2020s, with the enormous speed in excess of Mach 6. And lastly, by November 2018, Lockheed Martin mentioned that a prototype of the SR-72 was scheduled to fly by 2025. The aircraft will be capable of firing hypersonic missiles. So, what is this mysterious SR-72 predictably capable of? Well, it is said to have a turbine-based combined cycle propulsion system that combines a modified production fighter turbine engine with a dual-mode ramjet, also known as a scramjet. Scramjet is a type of ramjet in which the forward motion of the craft forces oxygen to mix with fuel at supersonic speeds. This allows the plane to accelerate from a standstill to Mach 6, which is twice as fast as the previous record holder, the SR-71 Blackbird. With this speed, it is undeniable that the Dark Star could reach any destination in the world in record time. What's more, this jet is expected to have the capability of loading weapon which could be launched to remote corners of the world from the unthinkable edge of space. While many have argued that the future airplane would be an enhanced version of the SR-71 Blackbird and be used in an intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR role, the hypersonic speed that it will have would enable it to be undoubtedly capable bomber, of course, depending on different kinds of factors. Though there are still so many questions left unanswered for this SR-72, the one fact that we could almost all agree is the time it takes to develop the aircraft will not be a short period. Even if it is certainly built based on past aircraft, the SR-71, enhancing the ability that is so out of this world will absolutely require more time and patience on the side of the military, not to mention the issue on budget and funding. To date, the United States has ample evidence of developing new modernized military tools and equipment, and of course some of them might be prioritized over the SR-72. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.